A sales slump is forcing big changes for a major retailer. As we first reported last night, Macy's is getting ready to close about three dozen stores. And now workers and customers are wondering if any local locations will be on the chopping block. I would assume consumer reporter Susan Hogan joins us now from Warwick with local coverage. Macy's has yet to announce exactly which stores will be closing. However, the owner at the Warwick Mall says he certainly hopes that this Macy's isn't on the list. Macy's announced it's closing up to 40 underperforming stores. That's about 5% of the total stores Macy's owns nationwide. Locally, there are three Macy's, one in Swansea, North Attleboro, and Warwick. Aram Garabedi, an owner of the Warwick Mall, tells Eyewitness News he has not heard whether the Macy's here is on the chopping block, but suspects it's not, saying the store is doing extremely well. Currently, there are 770 Macy's stores nationwide. Over the past five years, 52 have been closed, 12 new ones opened. The company plans to open what's called Macy's Backstage, which will sell discounted merchandise sometimes in the locations of stores it closed. The CEO of Macy's says shoppers are simply altering their shopping habits, buying more merchandise online. Macy's plans to release the list of 40 stores it's closing in 2016. I'm Susan Hogan, Eyewitness News.